Hey everybody, Michelle is back on this Saturday. As I uh, take in the moments of reflection of the things that are happening in my life, I, I do everything in my power to always give gratefulness and thankfulness to the people, to my silent supporters that, you know, that come into my life. We all have silent supporters. In other words, we have people that are assisting us and providing safety and protection. And we have no idea that this is happening. No, no idea at all. I sense and receive that. I know that what I am doing in my life and what I am attempting to do in my life would not be possible without the help of my silent supporters out there. I know you're there and I appreciate um, I appreciate the love, especially the universal love that I sense and receive every day. We all have protectors. We all have uh, people that are defending us. And we all have um, supporters in our corner. We may not know it because they're silent. That's, it's like a parent sometimes, you know. When your parents uh, do certain things, you think, you think you're doing it. And in most cases, you are doing it. But... Sometimes you just need that support to assist you and to guide you along the way. We call them, you know, a lot of people like to give glory to God. Okay, that's your, your choice or Lord. But we, we rarely, in my opinion, stop to give thanks and gratitude to human beings that are living amongst us, that are looking out for us. You know, we call them chosen ones we call them messengers we call them heralds we call you know prophets but sometimes and i think in most cases they are genuine human beings that are looking out for humanity and they're looking out for me and they're looking out for you and they are unassuming in most cases so i want to give i want to send out love to my silent supporters out there. I appreciate you. You know I appreciate you. You recognize me in ways that I know that you're there. And it makes all of this worth it. You know, a lot of people talk about loneliness. I don't experience loneliness, but I do feel alone sometimes. And that's that's a literal thing. I am, you know, in most cases, living by myself. Every now and then I'll have um, a certain level of companionship and that's irrelevant. But when I talk about loneliness and being alone, I'm talking about internal, okay? It's an internal uh, reality. Because like I said, lonely people can be lonely whether somebody is there or not. And people that are practicing proper aloneness, the same applies, but it's a different outcome. So again, I wanna send peace and love to all of my silent supporters out there. I appreciate you. I'm going to keep this going. I'm not going to stop because this is about the good of humanity. And I appreciate you coming along on, these, on this journey with me. Peace and love. And trust me, I'll be back.